Good evening, Tony. I'd like to pass on the congratulations of the FA for 20 years of Sporting Chance. I'm sorry I can't be with you this evening, but I really appreciate the work you're doing for survivors across our game. The 2016 revelations shocked us all. I've met a lot of the survivors, all of which are being helped by your organisation and the councillors. It's great work, keep it up, and keep helping those who really deserve help. Thanks again. I'm delighted to be able to offer Tony Adams and his teams, his chief executives, Peter Kay and Colin Bond, our most sincere congratulations on 20 years of the Sporting Chance Clinic. It was Tony's innovation. It was using people who'd been through those issues, which we felt was a massive step forward. It's the only clinic still that is for professional players. There's 24 hour help. Last year alone, 650 players, ex-players, current players, took advantage of the 24 hour helpline and dealing with massive issues like historic child abuse. Sporting Chance not only offered that to the victims, but also assisted grassroots victims as well, and were there to help the Football Association. All types of addiction, now mental health of course, is very much at the top of our agenda, and we have led the way in that. Sporting Chance should be very, very pleased, and Tony in particular, your innovation has kept you going and it's so worthwhile, it's unbelievable. Hi everyone, I'm so sorry that I can't be there to celebrate with you tonight. Tony, the work that you've done with Sport and Chance is fantastic. It really does make a difference to so many people. Hi Tony. I hope you have a fantastic evening tonight. I'm really, really sorry that I can't be there. I have no doubt it will be a sensational evening for the 20th year anniversary of Sporting Chance. Definitely deserves to be marked. That association with the RFL has existed for those 20 years and over that period, you and your organisation have served us tremendously well. The players and also the support staff who you have seen through your doors in that period. It was that association and the partnership that brought me to the conclusion 18 months ago that perhaps I might invite you to be the RFL president. I know at the time when we discussed it, I know exactly where I was uh, standing in Stockport uh, when we discussed that um, possibility that it was slightly left field. And I also knew by that point that you are slightly left field, which I like. And I hope that you just have a brilliant evening and that our association goes on for many years to come. I'm so sorry that I can't be there this evening, but I'm away on my world tour. I'm sending a very well done to Tony on 20 years of sporting chance. What an achievement. Two decades of helping sportsmen and women whilst completely changing the landscape of help for mental health issues in sport. Sporting Chance provides an invaluable point of contact for all people in sport who need help. It's fantastic that they will help over a thousand people this year. Have a great evening and well done, Tony. Good evening and my apologies that I can't be with you tonight. I just wanted to say congratulations to Sporting Chance. 20 years incredible achievement. Um, having been partly responsible for sending Tony into oblivion in 1996 uh, to have witnessed what he's achieved and what everybody with Sporting Chance has achieved uh, is nothing short of phenomenal. I think we live in a day and age where we're more aware than ever of the difficulties that life poses for our sports young men and women uh, and older ones. More pressure, more scrutiny, more intensity. There's no doubt in my mind that the work that Sporting Chance do in helping people with addictions, mental health issues, is more relevant than ever before. I think we're all conscious of the difficulties that people face. Sport is a more intense and more demanding environment than ever. And although the power of the media may have been dissipated, 
the power of social media is stronger than ever and more challenging for our young people. So well done to everybody there. Keep up what is an incredibly important piece of work and I hope you have a fantastic evening. Thank you.